hey guys welcome back to my channel so today i want to show you how to find the value of b and we need to know that the limit exists the limit exists that means we don't have positive infinity and negative infinity so in this one we have number two we put 3s minus s next we can do about factorization by number 3 and s next s minus 1 we can do another factorization now if I put negative number 3 go in here, you got number 0. That means we want to create the limit as 6. So we need to create one factor about s plus number 3 in here. So in this case, to do this one, I will set up the new one in here. This is about the factor of this one. Now we need to distribute this one and we have like this now let's compare to this one so we can see that we can put into the system of equations so in this case I will put about we have C and number 2, so C equals to number 2. We have S and S, so we have D plus 3C equals to B. The next one, 3D equals to this one. And now we need to calculate this one. So we put number 2 go in here. So, we can see that we put B go to the left, number 6 go to the right. And the second one, we have D and B again. So, we can put about 3D minus B equals to number 10. So, in this case, we just create another system. So that should be like this. Now we need to find D and B. So D equals to number 8. And the second one, B equals to 14. Now that means we find B equals to number 14. So we put number 14 go in here. And now we remember this one. So C we have number two. D we have number eight. And this one this is about twenty four in here. And here is the correct one. Now we can simplify S plus number 3. So in this one, we just have only 2S plus number 8 over S minus 1. And now we put negative number 3 go in here. So we got the final answer. We have negative 1 over 2. This is the end. Thank you for watching.